I keep hearing these weird claims and fandom that Star Trek was always intended to be about having no real set sexual identity and being whatever you wanted to. And so was Star Wars, conveniently. And of course, the X-Men is about the evolution into a non-gendered thing and being persecuted by those around you. This is hogwash, of course. Let's grab the X-Men in particular. So Homo Superior appears on the scene in conflict with Homo Sapiens, the same way that Homo Sapiens had to struggle against Neanderthals, etc. Maybe this is about the superior Aryan white race emerging into a world of partial human ultramatch and the struggle to survive in all of that muck to an increasing Aryan racial and cultural order. No, I'm not saying that's what the X-Men is about. In particular, of course, Magneto is Jewish. But surprise, surprise, what great human stories really do is they capture the human story in a way that is relatable by anyone, for any reason, from anywhere. You can always see yourself in these people's struggles because they are inherently human struggles apart from identity. So how one looks at it is different than how another looks at it. It is absolutely unique to the totalitarian, tyrannical mindset of the woke Marxist gender sexual idiots to think that everything was always about them. It was always about them. It's always going to be about them. And you can't make a version of anything unless you drive home that it can only be about them and not for anybody else. Then, of course, they say, well, it's not about you. Then they say nobody saw it because they're bigots. But it wasn't for anybody else. Real, well-written human stories, real art, whether it's comic books, novels, movies, cartoons, whatever it is, tell something that is relatable by anyone, regardless of which of the two sexes they're born, regardless of what color their skin is, or anything else about their background, you relate to it because humans all share the same struggles, which sadly is something you don't believe if you're a woke Marxist.